Hi, my name is Leanne Laughs and this is Nicola. And today we're talking about why we have grown his hair. And the reason why we've grown his hair is because why? For people that have cancer. For people that have cancer, that's right. And how long have you been growing your hair? For six years. For six years, that's right. Well done. And why are we cutting it now? You're going to bigger school next year, huh? Next year. Where are you going? Off. That's right. <laughs> so, so we've decided to grow his hair and cut it and donate it for children who have cancer and need wigs. When we first started, we had to make sure that his hair was 23 centimeters long, but since the last uh, measurement, his hair is now 30 centimeters long. So, which you can imagine, we have had a lot of judgment and backlash about and we've asked when we're going to cut our son's hair and he we've been told that he looks like a girl it hasn't really bothered him that people have judged him or asked him silly questions he's just shrugged it off which I think is quite sweet and mature for his age Cut someone that had hair that long, and he was a champ, eh? Hey? He was a champ. Yeah, I'm so, I'm so proud of the mom because she was nervous to cut the hair like two months back, and then already it looked like she wanted to cry. But look at her now, she's standing <laughs> strong. Yeah. Thank you for watching our video. We will be dropping off Nicholas's donated hair to the to the local <laughs> cancer association in Cape Town. And we just want you, we hope that your <laughs> missus message, we hope that the message has come across that no matter how old or young you are, there's always a way to do a small act of kindness. What does teacher Natalie always say to you? Choose kindness. Choose kindness, yes. Do you like your new hairstyle? Yes. Yes? How does it feel? Good. Good. Thank you very much. 